Rattle, rattle, rattle. What's up, everybody? Mm. So I haven't gotten warmed up yet today. We're just uh, firing up here. And this is one of my tracks, and we're going to talk about how to do a couple things over today. So hope you're all doing excellent. Uh, I will leave a link for this track. It's like an e blue backing track, and uh, you can find it in the playlist. So let's just kind of jump into it. We're going to talk about blending Dorian Mixolydian with the blues and how I kind of handle all that stuff. So let's just jump right into it. So as you can hear in this track, we're going to be in E here. So I'm going to be using basically everything's going to be kind of on this E pentatonic starting on 12, 15, 12, 14, 12, 14, 12, 14, 12, 15, 12, 15. You know the box pattern, I hope you know it. Right, within that, and then uh, we're going to kind of throw, where's our blues note in that? So, I kind of just tend to play it in a couple of different places, but really the main place it tends to show up here is on the 15th fret of the G string. Alright, so that's where that's going to be. Now our Dorian note. Right, that's going to be uh, the 14th fret of the D string. Okay, and then uh, if you want to throw that in, you can actually just do 12, 14 across the entire fretboard. Get some kind of uh, good Dorian sounds there with that added knife. And the other thing we're going to do is kind of add in the pentatonic here in a simple sort of way. Uh, pentatonic, add in the pentatonic mixolydian, that is. Everywhere we have a G or a third like that, like a 15 on the E, we're going to take it up a half step. So maybe down here on this 15 on the, or the 12th fret of the G string. And we're going to do that every time we're on an E chord. This is our E chord. Let's so start out with a big boomer bend here. Right, straight away pentatonic, easy, right? Spin a little. Put a little blues note in there. Now throwing that Dorian note. that blended with our mixolydian in there and we'll making a piggerty third. So B, D, A, E. And I'll leave a uh, link for the description of this track. Uh, link for this track in the description, okay? But kind of just, I, I'm just going to show you how I put all this stuff together and uh, kind of the different sounds I get and uh, that sort of flow to. So now that you know what's going on, here we go. Here's our A again, right? We got outlining the chords uh, so if you know your arpeggio that's just like B, D, A, and B. So now I'm going to extend that into the A chord. And 
And so really you could just kind of see that, um, you know, I don't think about it too much and I'm really not emphasizing one over the other. If anything, I, I find myself, especially in situations like this, kind of playing the Dorian. <laughs> Uh, and in uh, Dory mode with that kind of added Piggerty third there, and then sometimes straight away with the blues, and then there's like some good kind of shred patterns. Of... If you start to really kind of look at stacking all those scales on top of one another, you can come up with some really interesting things like that. So um, I think what I'm going to do now is just jump into another blues track of mine, and uh, this one's going to start out in C sharp minor. A, E. One more time. C sharp, A. And then that G sharp major going back to the E. And that's going to pretty much be, uh, we're going to be in this kind of C sharp, uh, E major blues territory. This is based on, I think the song is Manhattan. It's, a, it's an Eric Johnson song. You guys will probably recognize it right away. Um, yeah. Anyways, I can't remember the name of the song, but that's what the backing track's based on. At some point in time, it goes into E, and then um, that's where you're going to hear me kind of break into all that other stuff we were just talking about. With so blending in the uh, Dorian and the Mixolydian. Anyways, let me just do that now, and I think I might even throw on some delay here just for fun. So. Again, and I'll, I'll, I'll try to remember to leave this track in there as well, but anyways. Double stops here, this is something I like to do. Pretty simple to do. Anyways, hope you guys all have a really wonderful day and I'll probably be back tomorrow with some crystal stuff, just hanging out, having fun, chilling, and uh, if you got any questions, go ahead and throw them in the comments, like and subscribe, and I will talk to you dudes later on. Always be excellent to each other and party on. Woo!